Jax Taylor claims some drama was not featured on The Valley but he plans to change that going into season 2 that we are starting back up. I don't know if I'm allowed to say the day but in July, Jax, 44, revealed on the Thursday, June 20, episode of When Reality Hits Podcast. A lot is going down. A lot is going to happen, after watching the first season of the hit Bravo series, Jax decided to have a different game plan this time around, you guys are in for it because I'm going to make sure there are things that are going to be told this time. I feel like everything wasn't let out of the bag. There was a lot of like, why wasn't this shown? He noted. That's not going to happen. Some of you people are going to be in for a surprise, Jax's estranged wife, Brittany Cartwright, didn't sound thrilled about his comments while co-hosting the podcast. Jax, however, stood by his stance that not enough was shown the first time around that I don't need to bring the drama. It's already there. They just didn't put it on the TV and I'm shocked, he concluded. I'm excited for the season but there's some things that need to be out of the bag. Cat needs to be out of the bag on a few different things, later in the episode, Jax also hinted at an ongoing feud between him and another unnamed co-star. He mentioned several times that he wouldn't be inviting one person to his upcoming birthday party but didn't elaborate who or what caused the rift, The Valley, which debuted in March, is a spin-off of Vanderpump Rules featuring alums Jax, Brittany, 35, and Kristen Dutt. The reality show focused on a group of friends as they leave their wild younger years behind in exchange for parenthood and adult life in California's San Fernando Valley. The cast also included Danny Bucco, Mia Bucco, Michelle Lally, Jesse Lally, Jason Caperna, and Janet Caperna. Bachelor Nation's Jasmine Good and Britain's college pal Zach Wickham made appearances on the show as friends of the cast. Season 1 documented what led to Jax and Britney's separation and followed Jesse and Michelle months before they filed for divorce. The season finale specifically picked up several months after production initially wrapped up to capture Jax and Britney's attempts to co-parent three-year-old son Cruz, why haven't you done anything? Why haven't you changed? You screamed at me and said horrible things to me like I had no friends here and that nothing liked me here. Brittany told Jax in the June 4th episode. As soon as these cameras go down, you are going to text me a million messages. You are going to rage text the ST out of me. Be real, thank you, you have successfully subscribed, subscribe to newsletter subscribe by signing up, I agree to the terms and privacy policy and to receive emails from what's the gossip deal of the day lounge in linen for less with this button up that's now 69 off. View deal, check our latest news in Google News Follow us, check our latest news in Apple News Follow us, you have successfully subscribed. By signing up, I agree to the terms and privacy policy and to receive emails from What's the Gossip? Check our latest news in Google News, check our latest news in Apple News. The episode ended with Jax and Brittany reflecting on their future. It has been an amazing nine years. It really has. I have no regrets. I love Brittany. I love my wife, he noted. The only thing that is going to make or break this is time, Brittany's final words came off as a farewell message as well, adding, I know that I have put up with a lot of crap that Jax has put me through. But I wouldn't have Cruz if I had gotten rid of him a long time ago. Now that I have Cruz and I have woken up from the situation, I just feel like for his sake and my mental health I can't stay here anymore. The Valley has been renewed for season 2 and all episodes are currently on Peacock.